Hi everybody, this is Coach McCreary from Baseball by the Yard. Thanks for stopping by. When I come back, I'm going to show you one of the best off-season hitting drills that you can do, and it doesn't even involve swinging a bat. Hi everybody, welcome back. As I said, uh, today's video I am going to share with you a great drill uh, that you typically see more in older kids, uh, but it is a, a great one for any age, and as I said, it doesn't even involve swinging a bat. It's called the stand-in drill. Now, very often when teams uh, are working indoors in the off-season, uh, pitchers are going to be throwing indoors, off indoor mounds and so forth. There's going to be catchers there. And so it's very easy for pitchers to work on game-like situations because everything is pretty much the same as the outdoors. Of course, hitting is more difficult to do that. You have to do it in a cage or soft toss screen or something like that. But one of the most realistic drills that they can do inside is to stand in when pitchers are throwing their bullpens, okay? So basically what a, pit, what a hitter is going to do is get a helmet on, okay? Because obviously safety comes first and they're gonna get into the batter's box and they're gonna stand in and watch the pitcher throw his pitches, okay? During his bullpen session uh, and so forth, okay? So it helps pitchers because they have to throw their pitchers or pitches uh, with batters in the box. And so it makes it more game-like for them, but it also makes it more game-like for the hitters. Now, the next part of this is to make sure that hitters do it correctly uh, because there's a big difference between a kid getting in the batter's box and just standing here and watching the pitches come in uh, more as a courtesy to the pitcher. Okay, so my key uh, tip here for this drill is the hitter has to mimic exactly what they would do in a game from start to finish before every single pitch. Okay, so if my normal routine as a hitter, when I get in the batter's box for real during a game, uh, it might be this, okay? So I may kind of hang out here, set up my bat and my grip. I may put my foot in the batter's box, dig a little bit, tap the plate, look down, get my feet set, put my bat up, and I might even do some sort of a toe tap or move the bat or whatever it is. Okay, every hitter tends to have their routine that they do before every single pitch. So whatever routine you have, that's what you do every single pitch when you're standing in. Okay, you would not just get in the batter's box and just stand here and watch the pitches, okay? So if I was gonna stand in and my normal routine was that, I would mimic that and do exactly what I would do in a game, whatever practice swings, and I am getting ready. My entire mind is, this is a real game, and this is going to be an actual pitch from the pitcher. The only thing I am not doing is pulling the trigger and actually swinging. But everything else is exactly the same as if, let's say, I'm going to take the pitch. So I'm getting set here. Everything is exactly the same. Pitch comes in. I would do my normal load up and stride. And the only thing I'm not doing is pulling the trigger. Okay? Now, to make it even more authentic is don't have the pitcher tell you what's coming. Okay? The catcher can actually do signals, which, of course, is helping them get some game-like experience with pitch calling and location and so forth. And so the batter, of course, doesn't know that either. So I know some pitchers will just let everybody know. They'll go like this for a fastball. They'll go like that for a curveball or this for a changeup. But when you're doing stand-in drills, try not to do that so that the batter gets more practice on what they're going to have to do in the game, which is to recognize what pitch is coming and try to do that out of the pitcher's hand as opposed to being told what the pitch is prior to the pitch. Okay, folks, so those are some little tips about the stand-in drill. I think it's tremendous for hitters who get very game-like experience without, of course, being in a game. Pitch selection, timing, mechanics, loading up, all that great stuff that hitters need to do uh, when the game starts. And so get some practice in, in the offseason by standing in on those pitchers' bullpens. All right, folks, well, that's going to do it for today. Uh, try those stand-in uh, stand drills, and I think you'll find that is very beneficial to hitters. All right, folks, take care, and best of luck on your baseball journey.